Oh my god, saya kemar Crazy dog Welcome back to my channel or if you are new here my name is Tia and I live in a self-built tiny house in Finland and currently I'm not in my tiny house but I am at my parents main house which is where I usually spend my winters I thought it would be nice to have this chill chat since I haven't done that in a in a while I have noticed this funny thing happened to me in the past few years where I um, like I have noticed that during winters I started to feel a way more hippier than usual like I get this like um, I don't know it almost feels like when the winter comes uh, the hippie parts of me the hippie personality and the hippie vibes and all that like they come to life I'm more like like I feel more connected to the earth and surrounding and to myself and I feel more kind of like free and flowy and I don't know somehow like every time in the past like few years when the winter comes the hippie comes too <laughs> so like um the hippie side of me starts to show a lot more as you can maybe tell from the background as well um, I don't know where that is and I always feel like oh yes I want to do like now I want to go to a van trip like now I want to have um, dreadlocks in my hair and now I want to dress up like this and now I want to like sit in nature and I don't know and and it's like middle of the winter and I've already like packed my van for like winter ready so there's like nothing really there and um, it's very inconvenient to take the dreadlocks and it's like the hat season as well it's cold and all the cool cool flowy dresses are too cold to wear and then I'm like all right well the summer will come soon enough and i will get to do all those things and when the spring rolls around uh, it just feels like the hippie side of me is kind of going back to sleep and i am way more like cottage core vibes vintage vibes and cozy picnic vibes and let's stay home and grow vegetables which i guess is you know own way a bit hippie but um I have two very different personalities one one which really wants to travel and go with the van and just go with the flow and meet new people and go to festivals and hang out on a beach with like-minded people and then the other side of me is just like no let's just stay at home and make a little safety nest at home and read books and drink tea from these cute little cups and grow vegetables and then our garden and have like chicken and <sighs> yeah if anyone can relate please let me know in the comments if you are also a person who has very like sort of different two different passions and two different roads that they would kind of want to follow and yeah, it would be interesting to hear and I'm happy that I'm in my like hippie mindset that I feel more calm and connected with myself and things around me like it's really really good I just wish this would like stay but somehow like when the summer comes I'm in a, in a different moon set moon set? mindset? oh my god I can't even talk anymore uh, I only have one work week left at the library that I'm working but well, probably when this video comes out, uh, it's done by then. And then I have other future plans to make. 
but I feel optimistic about things, which is really positive. It's really good. Uh, that's my dog. Taika! Do you think you got so mad? Yeah, the money. You let it get some man. You let it get some money. Oh, yo, yo, yo. You let it put on. No, me to say, Guri. Oh, it's just a little bit sad. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Aha. Okay, bye. But for now, I think I'm going to enjoy this hippie bubble that I'm in and let things flow and do things that I feel inspired and just try to, I don't know, not to stress all the time what will come next. Trying to just live in the moment as cliche it sounds, but it's really hard to do sometimes. Like. Like I find myself thinking about the past all the time, or being ex or being anxious about the future. It's just, it's hard to live in the moment. I feel. But yeah, I guess this was a little update. What's been on my mind? Yeah.
<laughs> Currently taking my dog for a walk and I have been really enjoying this walk. It's such a beautiful day. It's snowy and it's not like super cold. I think it's about minus five Celsius so that's pretty decent but I still get like a red cheeks walking here so i have spent quite a time here in nature and it's been super super lovely a bit of a cloudy day but that's all right it's good for my migraine not to have sunshine even though it's really beautiful when it's sunny outside in a winter day and usually often means as well that it's really like cold outside if it's really sunny after this walk i'm gonna get inside and have a cup of tea and read a book perfect perfect plan for the day today is the 7th of December and it's actually Taika's birthday so I put this cake together for her well and unfortunately it didn't really stay Together it looks like a big mess, but I don't think Taika will mind. Taika, will you mind that your birthday cake is falling apart? You gotta take some pictures of you. He tarvi hotkia.
I'm going to end this vlog here. I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you so much for watching and being here. Have a Merry Christmas if you celebrate it and a Happy New Year. For me it will be very exciting because I will be spending Christmas and New Year's in Spain. And I will see you next year. I hope 2024 will be a special year for you. Bye!